many people thought I couldn't do it. So many people said I can't. So I, I'm, I'm always, I've always been the underdog from dropping out of school in the uh, eighth grade to having two kids by the time I was 15. So, you know, people didn't expect me to achieve anything. So I don't mind being the underdog. So when you knock me down, I know how to get back up and keep going. What's up, y'all? I'm Miss Pat, and I just moved to Plainfield, Indiana. Well, the corn is high and the black population is me and my damn family. I think it's like, you know, it's comedy, it's relatable, it's heartfelt, but it's also artful. Like we're bringing, I always call it a hybrid of television and theater, and I feel like the level of art that we're bringing in addition to the stories we're telling is holding people's attention, and I'm really proud of that. You know, I think it's the genuine and authenticness of our show. Um, you know, out of the pain comes the laughter, you know what I'm saying? And all the brilliant storytelling that goes on weekend and week out, and it's so relatable. Anybody, any ethnicity can step into our shoes, into our feet, into our shows, and understand what the situations are. You know what I mean? And I, so I think that's where it is. Relatability, obviously the funny, and obviously the story that's so touching, which is Pat's story. We thank him so much for exposing ourselves to the elements like that. So. What you do that for? I was just about to win a level of Call of Duty. You need to call a job and duty your ass up out my house. The world is constantly moving and shaking, and it's not waiting for anybody. But our 10 episodes, I guarantee you there's something in there that you can relate to. And by the end of that episode, we will have solved, answered your question, uh, you know, put your thought to rest, you know, by, by the end of at least one of those episodes. I know I have, and, you know, I've been shooting it. So, you know, it, we really, we're not helping people figure out life, but we're, we're helping you cope. It's a very honest show. Um, I love Pat Williams for the form that she created to talk about a different kind of black family. Um, so I was really excited to be a part of it. Well, for me, I think it's, um, I take a lesson out of her book because she's always saying, if you can't laugh about it, then you can't really heal from it. And so it's nice to see that someone has been through so much and so many trials and tribulations, but she's able to face it and create humor with it and also inspire people. You know, a lot of people go through stuff, some of the similar things that she has gone through and even not, it just teaches you that, you know, everyone goes through things, but just to like persevere and push through and we could all get through it. So she's really just an inspiration. We worked so hard for this. You know, I wrote this pilot when I was in college. I was a senior in college when I wrote the pilot. Had no idea that it would turn into this. I just knew that I love Pat and I loved her story and I love sitcoms. So I wanted to create, create a new version of the thing that I love so so it's just, it's just such a blessing such a blessing time I see her on set she gives such a vulnerability and an honesty that even me taking acting classes you can't really teach so just watching her her work ethic I've learned so much on how to really work hard in this industry from her and it's been a blast working with her I admire the fact that she never gave up and like this it's this resurgence of her talent and that you know, she's confident and funny and wonderful. I mean, I think that that is amazing, that her resilience. 